Hello everyone and welcome back to the final part of the story of Digimon World 2003. Mega Death is running away, let's go after him. Thinks he can beat us with Snatchmon and only warped us over here, that's kind of disappointing. Oh well. Well, what what are they? They kind of look like a black version of Venmon. Now, come Snatchmon and cover this world with darkness. Um. Oh, uh, what? Huh? Okay, now that definitely looks like an evolved sna uh, Snatchmon. <laughs> an evolved Venmon. I am Snatchmon. Forever the strongest Digimon. Go, Snatchmon. Destroy those foolish human beings. I need to work on my voice acting again. It's been a long time. Come on, I'll take you on. So I'm guessing those Digivolved Venmon combined together to form this guy. Who are you? Why do you order me? Oh, here we go. What are you saying? I am your tamer. Tamer? I do not require such a thing. I am always the strong Digimon. I bow down to no one. Uh-oh, here we go. What? What do you think I am? Who do you think I am? It does not matter who made me. I will absorb more data and become more powerful. First, I will absorb you! What? Oh! Okay, he just literally zapped him. He turned him into a little ball and just sucked him into the palm of his hand. Hmm. <laughs> kind of reminds me of Jubei of Onimusha 2. <laughs> just sucks all the souls. Whoa, hey, he's the tamer that raised you. I wouldn't say raised, but more like experimented on. Tamers and Digimon are one and the same. It's, all, it's, all, it's the power of teamwork and friendship. You know that corny line. So it is you. You defeated me when I was Venmon. Oh, so you remember me. But now I am reborn. I will show you my new powers. Uh, oh, huh? Uh, thought we were going to battle him. For a second there, where's he gone? Teleportation, yeah? Uh-oh, space quake. Again. <laughs> what? What are you going to do? I'll fuse with Gunslinger and be Galactic more. What? <laughs> what? Galactic mod? <coughs> what? Then I'll become one with the Earth. Okay, now that's ridiculous. I thought the I thought fusing with the damn space thing was stupid, but now he's saying he's going to become. Oh, come on! Did you evolve into a more powerful Digimon? Gaiamon. How does he even know he's going to Digivolve? Oh, come on! This is stupid. Then it won't just be humans. Everyone on Earth will die. That is irrelevant. All that matter is me. Wow. I won't let you! And try to defeat me when I am Galacticmon. No, I will defeat you. I will! I can't let you do this! Fine then. We shall meet in space. The final frontier! <laughs> I will transfer your matrix data. Oh, how kind of you! Watch as I digivolve into Galacticmon! Again, this is a Digimon that just, you know, they kind of just... Boom, you know. Oh, and here we go. Here we go, we get to... Oh, okay, cutscene. Hello. There's the gunslinger. Okay, and he's fusing somehow. Don't ask me how. That's crazy. He looks like some sort of dragon thing. Machine dragon. Kind of badass, I guess. Badass looking and stuff. Um, there you have it. It says it's going to transfer a matrix data, but if you're fused to the gunslinger, where am I? And I'm on space. I'm at, I'm, at, I'm at space. I'm floating on space. Yeah, look. And I forgot to heal Gearmon, damn it. So, yeah, now we really are floating above the Earth. Somehow. Uh. I don't know. <laughs> Game logic. Anyway, this guy's 
I would say he's kind of dark, but he's machine, so... You know? I'd just say probably dark and machine won't work well against him, so... Yes, he has a lot of HP. His laser's pretty powerful if it hits. And he does like, I, I kind of call it like a beak attack. He sometimes zooms in and whacks you with his beak. That's quite uh, tough as well. I'm gonna see if I can... Can I at least get one final purification? I mean, this is the final boss, or will I block? I'll block, okay. Not that I'm complaining, it's just... It's gonna take a while to whittle them down. But I'm gonna, uh, well, so I'm gonna swap between the, the, the three again, so... Yeah. Final purification! <laughs> he blocked again. Even the beak attack. Oh, yeah. It's kind of weird looking from, you know, this kind of angle bit, you know. Mm. I think... Mm, I'm thinking I might leave him in because there is a phase that does happen when you defeat him. Um, it's... You can't do nothing about it. Um, so, I don't know. But yeah, this is this is the um, so-called final boss music. I don't know if I like it, if I'm honest. Um, not so sure. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna heal. Ultra charge. To be honest, I didn't have many. Um, I didn't have many charges. Um, I've got uh, what's his face? Omnimon. Omnimon. Not Omnimon. Sorry, I've got. Um, Paladin mode, Pyrgemon. He he's got healing abilities, but you know, I think he can heal the whole party. I think even in battle, I think I'm not 100 sure. But let's try a uh, Inferno on him. See how he likes that. Burn. Yeah, but what are we standing on? <laughs> oh man, what? Ah, oh, they did anything. Archibald, attack. Oh, sorry, it's resistant to fire. Hmm. Oh, I managed to hit Ogum Ogumon. Didn't do that bad though, so... T-Saw? Finish him off? Maybe? Slash! Cut his neck open. Okay, that's a bit harsh. <laughs> That'd have been cool though. It's just a machine anyway, so... And there he goes! What? The body? What do you mean the body? That thing at the back? That was actually something. Ragnarok cannon! Yeah, so apparently, because he's the gunslinger, he can actually fire the Ragnarok cannon himself on us. So, we gonna turn into Oinkmon? No, instead he's gonna reduce our Digimon's health to one! You can't avoid that, and no matter how strong your Digimon is, even if it's like 999, it will go to one. And this is the real Galactic Mom. This is the real Galactic Mom. I don't know what the other part was, but this is the real Galactic Mon. Poor Omnimon. Vimon. I need you, buddy. Take over. And this is the this is the intro theme music. And you know what? I think it actually is quite fitting for this boss. I like it. Yeah, he has T Sword. Um <laughs> Which is great. <laughs> no. The problem with this guy is that he will he will remember a technique. It can be any technique. It's normally it's normally um, I think in the last phase um, he'll learn one of the techniques. So he could have learned T Sword from um, from Omnimon. He could have learned that Inferno attack. You know anything. He normally doesn't learn T Sword, so I'm kind of annoyed that he has because T Sword will now paralyze me. Which means I might not be able to attack him at all. Which is, you know, great. <laughs> we'll see how we go, but, yeah. That's one of the advantages of T-Sword, is you can actually paralyze the opponent. You don't always paralyze the opponent, but you know. Yeah, frozen and can't move. Oh, I hate that. He's only done it once. Normally, because I've done this a few times. Um, uh, Normally he doesn't absorb finishes, but he has, so yeah, he copies your technique, which is kind of annoying. I think he only does one. 
And he loves the block. And he blocked every attack. Lovely. And he counters, yeah. Even though he blocked. Even though you're supposed to only only counter if you get hit. So that's kind of unfair, but oh well. What can you do? Damn it, frozen. Can't move. Yeah, so. Great. Why did he have to absorb that damage? God damn it, he got a critical. Oh man, this ain't going well at all. I did fine in the practice run. Practice run, but it, oh god damn it, two turns and I was frozen. Damn, this might be it. Not a critical. What the hell? Ah, oh, man, I might just die just for being screwed over by my own technique. Right, I'm gonna heal. I oh, know what am I doing? I need to do this. Um, where's my heal? Uh, final heal. Heal almost all, all, all of Alloy's HP, I think, so yeah. God damn. Oh man, I don't think I've got anything to stop par paralysis anyway. I did not expect that, I will admit. Caught me off guard. Um, okay, do I make a blade again? I'll have to switch it up, but I'm pretty certain no matter who you tag to, he'll keep that technique. Which is great. <laughs> yeah. That's not even his most powerful attack. He's got another one. It's pretty powerful if it hits. It can be anyway. Try impact rush. Try and get at least a hit. No. God damn it. Countering again. <laughs> yeah, well, this is a final boss, so it's to be expected. God damn it, block Vemon! <laughs> oh, tag. Gearmon, come back in. Uh, do I want to try and make a Gargamon? No. Because his is all machine techniques, so it'd be no good against Galacticmon, unfortunately. So back to back to um, Gallantmon. Maybe final purification? Try it. I mean, great, I'm probably going to be frozen now, but, you know. Will that count as a physical? Or not? Ah, uh, no, I don't think it did. God damn it. <sighs> damn it, stop using T-Sword. He has an attack. God damn it. <laughs> stop it. <laughs> Oh man, it's just using nothing but that. <coughs> Rather you didn't use that, but I'm dying here. Oh dear. This will take longer than I want it to do. <laughs> Gilmon is frozen again! Gilmon is frozen again! <laughs> oh man, this is, this is bad man, this is... <sighs> Record and curse, man. Seriously, why did you have to absorb that technique? <laughs> Seriously. Oh, Vemon defrosted. That's all right. <laughs> but Gearmon's gonna die. Block, goddammit, Gearmon. <laughs> I'm guessing. I'm guessing. Your evasion goes down because you're frozen, I'm, which kind of makes sense, I guess. Yeah. Still frozen. I haven't hardly managed to do anything on him. Uh, stop using that damn technique! God damn it! Uh, finally! Oh, okay, I can still block then. It's not impossible. Oh, this is painful. <laughs> it's painful to watch. Uh, paying for the watch and paying for the play, man. I think I'm just gonna have to tag, you know, again. Omnimon, come back out. <clears throat> I'll try and get some damage on him. Uh, do T sword on him. I know it's not gonna paralyze him. I'd like to be proven wrong. 
Uh oh. He lowered his head. He lowered his head. Um, that normally means that he's going to prepare his powerful technique. Um, I think it's. I think it's just when you hit him enough times, his head goes down. So, and again, he he's blocking. He does like to block those triple moves a lot. Unfortunately, you can get away with hitting him sometimes. So I do try my luck, but you know. Here we go. Here's the attack. Let's see how much damage it's going to do. Yeah, it's like a wind beam machine move thing. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> like I say, sometimes it can do a lot of damage. But our stats are pretty high, so... God damn it. You shouldn't be allowed to counter, you cheater. And then he gets to attack again. That's not how countering works, but, you know. Well, actually, no, it kind of is. <laughs> when I think about it. We're supposed to block and counter, but how it works for us is, you know, you get hit and then you counter. But, you know. Oh, god damn it. Now Ogamon's paralyzed. Everyone's paralyzed. No. And there's, there's nothing I could do. It's just wait and hope that I get through to attack. Really. Can't you go back to your other attack? <laughs> Please. Inferno, at least do something. No? No? Okay, he really doesn't want to let up. Fine. I'll just have to attack. You beauty. Thank you for blocking that. And I defrosted. Oh no, it wasn't me. Okay, it was Geomon. Okay. T-Sword. Paralyze? Yeah, 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 yeah. No? Alright. <laughs> Fine. Just paralyze me instead. Well, when they said final boss, well, it's more annoying than in anything, but, you know. Ah, oh, good work blocking there, but you're still frozen, so... And you're just going to keep using that technique. Oh, man. <sighs> he had to absorb that technique. Well, at least T-Sword seems to be chipping his damage away. You know, he is the final boss, so I'm not surprised it's going to do super load of damage, but, you know. Good work, good work. I think I'm going to tag. Yep. And then I, when I get low, I'll probably use final heal so I can heal everyone again, so. Really handy to have this one. Not only is he powerful, but, you know, he can heal the whole party in battle. I think there's only one other Digimon that can do that in this game that you can raise up to. But she isn't very strong. She isn't very strong. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. He's going to attack again. Soon, anyway. Yeah, I'll just stick with the finishers. At least finishers hit. But um, the free hits, unfortunately, no. Nah. Sometimes they do. I, like I say, I just haven't had much luck. Oh, crap, he blocked. <laughs> and he's going to counter. And I blocked. Good man. And then he's going to attack with his beam. Let's see how much damage he does with uh, on the beam on. Oh, I blocked. Ha! Huh? Too bad for you. I make a blade. I couldn't get one final purification off. I'm disappointed. What can you do? Go! Slash! Nearly done. Nearly done. Well, I don't think I managed to attack him at all with Geomon. I don't think I did. I might have. I'm not sure. I don't think I did. I think I was just so unlucky. Uh, I I want to do Impact Rush, but I don't want to risk it. Let's just stick to our Omega Blade. It's probably my strongest technique right now I can use. So. This won't finish him, I don't think. One more hit after this, and it should do it. Yeah. And then we'll be good. We'll be good. Frozen. There's not got much left to go for though, so we should be alright. Come on, just gotta get free. Just just once. You can do it, Vimon, just once. Come on. 
No, Beamon! I'm glad you're healing and stuff, but I kind of need you to do something. <laughs> do something! Or not. <laughs> uh. All because he absorbed that damn move that freezes you. Yeah. If he hadn't have done that, if he'd absorbed anything else, it would have been fine. Would have been able to tolerate anything else, you know. And he didn't block it. And, 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 he's dead. Oh, finally. God damn it. Cutscene. And he's blowing up. I don't think he'd be able to fuse the earth. He still wasn't big enough to, you know, but whatever. Plus, like I said, he, he said he'd transfer our matrix data, but surely we are actually above the planet. So it's like, how can we even be here? Oh, I don't know. It's game logic. Oh, and the meteorites are going to blow up and destroy things. and, and Well, not, I guess. <laughs> Took a damn long time, but we did it. Oh, victory! I believe it's my first RPG I've done on the channel completed. Hey, there'll be more. <laughs> there'll be much more. So yeah, this is the credits to Digimon World 2003. It's been a long, long playthrough. Um, I've had, you know, on and off issues with this game, recording issues. HTPVR screwing up. Um, I think I started off this, this paper with a dazzle, which means it's definitely been around for a long time. You know. Um, overall, like I said, it's not my most favourite. I think I still prefer the first in the series. But I still enjoy this. Like I said, I played this when I was a kid and I loved it. I, st I, st I still loved it. It's a little, you know, it can be a little bit tedious, but you know, it's kind of RPGs. It, it has that element where you grind and, you know. I wish the trance, you know, even like Submarine Mon and Digimon, I wish they were a little bit faster. But it's not too bad when you know what you're doing. It's just when you're not knowing what you're doing, you can get a little bit frustrated because you get lost and stuff. And, you know, you just got to be prepared. You know, like with any RPG, you just got to make sure you've leveled up and you, you're, you know, you're alright and stuff. But overall, it's a pretty good game. Um, this was the last Digimon I played, Digimon World game I played. Um, well, I played a demo of Rumble Arena, but I didn't really like it. Um, other than that, really, this was it. You know, we only had World 1 and 2003. We had nothing else, you know, nothing else at all. But, um, yeah, it's been fun, guys. It's been really, really fun. However,. It's not quite the end yet. We're back. Kasanaji City, Street Corner. What's been going on? We don't get it three months later, I don't think. Oh no, actually, yeah, the player does actually uh, explain it, so here we are. Once I defeated Galactic Mon, once I defeated Galactic Mon, it was all good. Oh, you're, you're facing up now. It's already been three months. It feels like a dream. Yeah, so not too long. But yeah, three months, eh? What's happening now? What are Ivy and Teddy doing? Oh, we're waiting for them again, are we? The opening ceremony is going to start. For what? Is Digimon Online back again? I like how that... I like how that traffic light went green. Like... Look like it indicate for you know um, the cars to go, and the, the girl just walked across the road. <laughs> but the way they've done it, they've kind of done it backwards. They've kind of done it as if the you know the traffic lights for cars and the traffic lights for people. It's kind of weird, but thank you for waiting. The autumn, the opening ceremony for Digimon Online is about to begin. DMB TV is live from the digital world for the first time in history by using the optical network. Oh, so they're actually telling the news inside the network. That's kind of cool. With that, let's connect to the let's connect to this relay with a, with the digital world. Okay. Back to you and Ted. Kurt is amazing. You created a new company and started Digimon Online in place of Megami. 
Here they are. Hey, you're already here? You're talking to yourself again, it's creepy. <laughs> Not this again. You guys are late again. I've sent some deja vu here. I've been waiting for over ten minutes. God damn. You don't <laughs> it's not a very patient person, are you? What am I supposed to do about that? You came too early. If you wanted to go that badly, why don't you just go? Here we go. Back to the rivalry again. Arguments. <laughs> hey, dude, I saved I saved the world. I get some credit, don't I? Hey, hey, guys, got guys. Chill. Chill, man. Chill out. Let's go to the online center. Yeah, Teddy's got a right idea, man. Let's go. Let's uh, go. So yeah, we've got this cutscene again. A little bit shorter this time. We just kind of warped there, but uh, yeah. It's not quite the end, folks. No. But what can we do now? I mean, we've won, haven't we? What, what is there more to do inside the Digimon world? That's what I want to know. Ah, oh, back into the login room. Here we go again. Just like at the beginning of the game. We've come far, people. We've come far. Huh? Ivy and Teddy aren't here. Hmm, knowing them, they've gone on ahead. Well, considering last time we went ahead of them, you know. Mr. GBK, is it? Welcome to Digimon Online. Yes, you should be saying, oh, the, the king saved the world, man. We'll be practicing today f to prepare you for your start. You're restricted to the East Sector and Central Amaterutsu. Yeah, so, uh, in other words, Amaterutsu is now your Asuka server, and we can only go to the East Sector and Central Sector. And I don't think you can ever go back to the North Sector or West Sector, or South Sector. Unfortunately, everything is compiled to one sector. It's a little bit disappointing, but unfortunately that is just how it is. The circuit boards apparently, well, it says there's more circuit boards and seabed areas, but really they've just kind of made it so that the areas kind of all connect together, but you're not going to be going to any other sectors, so, you know. Yep, your date is pretty much the same as last time. All your techniques, digivolutions, everything is still the same. And, uh, yeah. And she just says, you know, be sure to save with Gardramon. Because, obviously, if you don't, then, obviously, you're doing that boss all over again. Which, of course, I will. So, yeah. Now, as I may have mentioned, um, if this was Digimon World 3, the American release, it ends. After the cutscene with the end, the ending, it ends. The end. You don't get none of this extra stuff. And like well, I said, I've never actually researched this, but I think it's fair to say it's fairly obvious because America got Digimon World 2 and 3. We did not get Digimon World 2. Hence why I believe this is called 2003. Probably one, because it released 2003. And two, because, well, you know, we didn't get Digimon World 2, so for them trying to say sorry, I guess, I don't know, trying to fill us in, they're like, we'll give you a bit of extra stuff from Digimon 2003. Now, I don't know why we didn't get Digimon World 2. We got one. I don't know. Maybe just we didn't want it for, I don't know. I really don't know what happened. Maybe it didn't do as well in, in you know, in America, and they just thought there's no point. I'm not sure. But yeah, if you were playing the World 3, American release, you wouldn't get all this. 2003, we get some extra stuff to do. So, yeah. And there's people in different places, so. So, yeah. What are we going to do here, though? Well, I'm not going to really... I'm not going to... I'm not going to um, ex say anything just yet. But, pretty much, we're going to put those legendary weapons to the test. There's a real reason why we had the legendary weapons. We've got the old grandpa dude back again. Ha ha ha, I've been hearing rumours about you. You've turned out to be some tamer. Yeah, I'm not going to battle him. Here's Kale. I think you can... ...dole her, I think. 
or um, maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. Yeah, maybe not. Oh, we've got Ogamon and Vemon here. Hello. Mmm, that smells good. Smells like we're having burgers today. Burgers? Is that so? Ah, so you're the GBUK, the famous tamer. We're all trying to beat you. Don't let your guard down. Oh, I like a challenge, Ogmon. If Vemon, Geomon, and I fought, I wonder who would turn out to be the strongest. Probably Vemon because Pyrrhodramon. So, and considering I have well all three of them, so <laughs> we've done it. Go, d d go. We've got it. Well, yeah. We've done it though, folks. Um, I think. Do we need to heal? No, we don't. It's all done for us. Lovely. So yeah. Gargamon says something a little bit different. Even uh, Gotamon says something a little bit different. Like they pretty much say you want to save, you want to rest. But I think like Gotamon says something like, "Oh, there, you know." Like say like for example, she says, "You know, welcome to our win. Would you like to stay?" She might say, "Hello there. You're staying at our inn today." You know, she'll say something slightly different, but it's pretty much exactly the same anyway. So, you know, either way, you know, all good. But um, yeah. For the story, we're pretty much done. But if you guys would like to find out what we actually do in this in these extra parts, then you'll have to join me for the next episode. Hope you've enjoyed the playthrough so far, and uh, hopefully you'll uh, enjoy the rest of the uh, extra parts as well. Until then, I'm Jay from the Gamers UK. Thank you for watching.